Okay, Beth. Today's your day. You can do this. You are... The gravy man. Oh my gosh, the gravy man. How did you get yourself into the gravy business? No, 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 no. Okay, we're in Minnesota. This is the land of milk and gravy. We can do anything. This is awesome gravy. Okay. How you doing today, ma'am? I got a lovely big bowl of gravy for you. This is the most awesome gravy on the market. Oh, oh God. Day, um, I, I like to go to Bo's ice cream. It's like really good, and like it just makes me so happy. And sometimes, <laughs> it's okay. No, it's not okay. I'll get some ice cream. It's okay. Okay, okay, yeah. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it for me, man. It's that way. I've been better. You've been better. Yeah. You know, I bet you some ice cream would be just the thing for you. Yeah, yeah. Uh, do you yeah. like raspberry? What? I do. Hold on one second. It's kind of nice. Why don't you give that a shot there? Yeah, thank you. So, uh, what's your name? Pat Oglesby. Pat Oglesby, huh? Mm -hmm. What do you do, Pat? What's got you down? Gravy. Gravy? I'm a gravy salesman. Oh. I mean, I came to Minnesota, the land of milk and gravy, to make my fortune, but you'd have to be a superhero to sell this kind of stuff. You would have to be. You know, I know a story about a superhero. Yeah? Yeah, and you know, it might be just what you need to hear. Way back when, I was just a little tyke back then at the beginning. There was a young boy. All he could think about was becoming a superhero. He came from a family of crime-fighting superheroes. His father, Sonic Boom, had the gift of running the speed of light. His mother, Iris, had looks that could kill. But he himself was a special child. He did have a very unique gift, but unfortunately, his gift wasn't practical for Dad, crime fighting. He's gonna grow up with a complex and his own father, his no, own listen. father is making fun his of him. His parents I'm just couldn't like, accept him has, for who he okay? was. It's like, God, how many kids have others? others, others. discovered was failure, ridicule, and rejection. He tried his best to become a crime fighter just like his parents. Ah, but 
can you do this? But he just wasn't cut out for it. Hey there, why don't you get up now? It's not all about using your superpowers to fight crime. It's about using your gifts to help people. And that's when he realized his true calling. Being a superhero has absolutely nothing with using your power for yourself. No, it's how you can use your power for others. That's what makes a true superhero. You know what? I feel better. I knew you would. <laughs> By the way, this, this is the best ice cream I have ever had. Yeah. What's your secret? If I told you that, it wouldn't be a secret now, would it? <laughs> I guess you're right. <laughs> Sure. What's the name? Sarah. Okay. To Sarah. Always yours, Bo Vine. Thanks, Mr. Vine. You're my hero. <laughs> I know. My guess of the golden voice seems Neil Young and water boys killing them softly. Like Romeo and Juliet, a broken heart, but better yet, a song so lovely. And you were fabulous, fabulous last night. And the sound was good, and the crowd was good, and you smiled just right. You were fabulous, fabulous, that's right But you look so lonesome Singing that love song Christine came and Christine went while you crisscrossed the continent Five years younger oh, You always looked so far away Hoping she'd come back one day One day stronger Fabulous last night Yeah, the sound was good And the crowd was good And you, you smiled just right You were fabulous Fabulous, that's right But you look so lonesome